What's up, Twisties? It's Twisted Pandora, and welcome back, everyone, to another event on the channel. This one is known as Beatland, and in today's episode, I'm gonna show you guys how to get each and every single item inside today's Roblox event, Beatland. And to start off, let's talk about what actually is inside this land of beats. That is a total of 18 items, six of them completely free, and 12 of them you have to pay Robux for. They're located in two areas. One area right over here, which is known as the Record Shop, and this area right here which is the t-mobile shop we don't have that in canada but anyways you can go ahead and talk to this lovely lady here and you can figure out what you need to get from this shop there's only four of them here two of them are robux as you can see here the speed hair for 70 and the white and magenta vintage phone for 35 robux then there are two of them that are completely free but you have to do missions to get these coins that are only found in this game to unlock them so it's gonna require a little bit of grinding right now they are each worth 500 in-game beat coins Coins. One of them are wings, and one of them is a hyper-fast 5G dance move. We're going to move on from the T-Mobile shop into the record shop where the rest of the items are located in. Because if there were four of them inside the T-Mobile shop, that means there are 14 others inside the record shop. Against the wall, you guys can see the three other free items here. There is a boon box for 450 beat coins, a frog hat for 400 beat coins, and a peace sign for 350 beat coins. Now, you might be wondering, wait, you said six free items, but you've only only talked about five well that's because the sixth item is only available by doing a scavenger hunt as seen here the scavenger hunt award the mission is to find all eight letters that are scattered throughout this map but not just in one day you have to do that for five days not in a row just five days total once you do that you unlock that beautiful vinyl i don't know if it's for your back for your front for your head i don't know but it's a vinyl that looks pretty cool i guess right Woo! Oh, and also the paid items, you can go ahead and talk to this guy. You see there's four items there. Wait, one of them's three Robux. Oh, it's because it's a t-shirt. That makes sense. And then there's also some 90 sunglasses for 30 Robux and a beanie for 55 Robux. Go ahead and talk to this guy over here to get new items. The beanie and the shirt you already seen. So there is a hit back for 85 Robux and a whistle for 30 Robux. Then over here, when you talk to Boris Brach, yeah, I don't know how to say his name. I'm sorry, I butchered it. We get a t-shirt for 15 Robux, a shoulder duck for 85 Robux, and a Ventian face mask for 200 robux the last items are available here there's a glove hat actually this one should have been free this one looks hilarious and then there's this one here that's a snail hat that i like as well the frog hat is the one that you can get for free but anyways guys that is a total of 18 items that you can unlock here inside the game again 12 of them you have to use robux but six of them are absolutely free now let's go ahead and talk about how we actually get the beat coins because i did bring that up earlier there are beat coins that are scattered throughout the map like right over here see i just got it but it's only worth two B coins like what in the heck are you kidding me guys and they're around the map but that's gonna take a long time to do when you first join the game there is a tutorial that shows you that you can do missions to get some B coins over here as you can see is the advertiser and every time you do the job you get 20 B coins so let me show you guys a brief look at what that's about there'll be arrows guiding you to the little glowy thing and here you just hold E or I don't know what it is on the mobile I guess just hold on the screen tap on it I'm not too sure but doing it long enough you put up a poster and E each time you put up a poster for the advertising purposes, you get yourself 20 in-game beat coins. Probably the best in my opinion, but let's take a look at the other jobs just in case you're curious. There's a city janitor here that is a little bit lame, even though it's 20 per action. You have to go way far away. Like, I, look, look at this. I gotta go into the cinema to do this job? Like, oh my gosh, who, who dropped all the popcorn over here? Okay, now we gotta sweep the floor. But doing this job, you gotta go everywhere in the map, not only just in the main area here, but inside buildings and that's why i don't recommend this job then there's another job over here called bouncer i highly don't recommend this job because to even do it you need to pay 300 in-game coins to unlock the job like what in the heck are you doing now nah, we're not gonna do that one that is a no go now moving on to the fourth job which is inside the record shop this one though only has a salary of 14 unfortunately so when you do it every action will only be worth those 14 beat coins but the thing about this one and why it's cheaper is because everything happens inside this record shop so if you don't want to go around the whole map you can just go ahead and do a bunch of actions in this record shop for a little bit less but if we're going to talk about a little less let's talk about the last job because 
it's gonna be the easiest because you barely move anywhere, but it's gonna be worth a lot less. So going inside the beats area, let's head over to this location here where you can be a waiter. The salary is only 10, but the best part about this, guys, when you take this job is that everything is available right here. So you wanna make a cup here, boom, you're done. You only get 10, but hey, the next job is right here. So it depends on what you wanna do. I either recommend the waiter job or the advertiser job. Now, keep in mind, how many coins do we need to unlock the free items? Well, that's gonna be a total of 2,200 beat coins. For example, if you do this waiter job, you're gonna have to do 220 actions. But if you end up doing the advertiser job, you're only gonna have to do 110. Now that you guys know how to get the beat coins, let's talk about the final free item where you have to do the mission by finding the letters that are scattered throughout the map. Keep in mind, the locations of the letters will change each and every single day. So in this video, I'm gonna show you guys just the location for day one. So let's get the show on the road by starting and resetting here just so we can start in the beginning. Now that we're back at spawn, let's get the eight letters today. The first one is gonna be available inside the T-Mobile shop right back here, the letter D. And then we're heading out of the letter D. We can go and take a left immediately because at the end of this road, you guys will be able to get the letter T. Now turning back around and continuing in a clockwise way, well, I'm gonna jump on here because why the heck not? We're gonna go around the back of this green building and jumping on another one of these, we get the letter B, then go Going this way, we can go into a really dark alley. Oh, that's a little creepy, but we're gonna get the letter N. Turning back around and heading into the huge nightclub where there's a DJ playing. You guys head all the way to the back of this nightclub into the washroom and collect your next letter, the letter L. And then before we head back out of here, let's hop up the stairs. You have to go up two flights of them, by the way, because we're in a rooftop patio. Then you gotta head all the way to where there's a creepy pot happy playtime looking character to get your letter A. And then jumping down from here, let's go grab the letter E because it's already in the main area. I kind of just glazed over it. Let's grab that one. You can grab that at any time because it's right in the main center. And then heading into the record shop, the final letter, another letter A. You just have to go to the back where there's a computer room. Grab that letter A and there you go. As you guys can see, you also get some beat coins for doing that each and every single day. Once you get to day five though, you get a free UGC item, which is this beautiful record now with that ladies and gentlemen that will bring us to the end of today's episode i hope it helped you out if it did be sure to drop that like down below subscribe if you're new to the channel and don't forget to use star code twisted with two eyes whenever you're buying robux or premium to help support the channel and i don't know about you guys but i gotta grind some jobs and some missions to get some more beat coins to get the free items but for right now this is twisted pandora staying inside beatland and as always don't forget to stay snazzy